What's good guys? We checking in. It's a new day and we got some more package for you. Yes, we just got home. The packages were in front of our house. Good thing no one took them. But we got a package right here. Super light. I have no idea what it is. We ordered so much stuff online that I can't keep track. I have like four shipments on the way. Oh, they're also Christmas presents. If they are Christmas presents, we may or may not share them just because in case they're watching, we don't want them to know. Yeah. But for now, let's open this one box. Wow, like a pro. You look like you've been doing this for a while. Did you see that? No, I didn't. Did sure? Did you see it? Yeah. Did you see it? No. All right. It's your present. Did you see it? No, I didn't. Are you sure? I'm positive. It's my present? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I can't show you. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't see? No, I didn't. Swear. Yeah. Swear. I swear. So I also got a package. That one's under Raph's name. But I got my own here. I already know what it is. It's Raph's present. This one, I could resist. I'm not letting her have this one any sooner. She, ha she gonna have to wait. Anytime you get a package, you always gotta QA it. Unbox it and check it out and make sure you got the right one. Otherwise, it's bad. You'll have to contact the merchant. We're gonna part ways and uh, we're gonna check our packages. So we'll catch you guys later. And... Oh. All right. Now go. You guys, I'm pretty disappointed. This is the reason why you need to open every package that you get. Cause I did not get what I ordered. They sent me the wrong skin size, man. Whatever. Positive vibe. Just gotta return it. I mean, hopefully exchange it and I really hope they have the size that I need. Oh well. We'll work it out. <sighs> Wish me luck. I really hope they have it because I really want to give this to Rav. Damn it. I literally just checked and the item, the specific size that I ordered, not even there anymore. What a bummer. So what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna give it to Raph now. Show her what the fuck happened. Here you go, babe. I'm sorry. It's not your size. But you can oh try God. it on to see if it fits. Ooh. Is that why you're mad? Because it's not the right size? And they're sold out. That's probably why they gave it to you. It's too freaking big. Yeah. It's a half size bigger. I can fit a five. I know. That's what I ordered. They're cute though, huh? Yeah, they look really good on you. Too bad you can't have them. I'm bitter. That's why. This checks over stripes. Checks over stripes. Adidas, I really like you, but today you fucked it. You fucked up, man. I'm sorry, baby. I tried. Adidas just doesn't know how to read. Okay. Did your receipt say five? Mm-hmm. As you can see, it says five. How hard is that? I'm sorry, baby. It's all good. All right, I'm done being negative. I'm cutting it. Vibes. Thank you. It's the thought that counts. What's going on, guys? Check this out. We're at a gas station, y'all. This is a crispy, crunchy chicken unboxing. Here is our first item. Ooh, damn. Look at that. There's glistening and all that. Sorry it's dark, we're just in the car as you can see, but we're about to have some. I hope it's as crunchy as they say. We're gonna have some while it's still fresh. Yeah. Don't judge. Thank you, baby. Mm -hmm. Cheers, guys. 
And not the squirtage. It's crunchy, but not as crunchy as Popeye's. Mm -hmm. The crunchy parts are good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I expected it to be more crunchier. Me too. So did I. Because it was crunch. It said crispy, crunchy. So. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good though. Mm -hmm. They're not bad for some gas station chicken wings. Mm -hmm. It was twelve forty-eight. Not bad for eight weeks, eight piece chicken. Three piece butter biscuits. It's a no for me. No? The biscuits. Did I just eat off of your bite then? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Very bland. Got stuck all over my whole mouth. There was barely any portions with honey butter. So I guess if you order it, you gotta ask for extra honey butter. That part. The part that I do have it tastes good. Mm-hmm. All right, we're out to pick up some packages and then we're gonna head home. So this is where we're eating today. What's it called? It's called Marugame Udon in Stonestown's mall. Is it mall or Galleria? Stonestown yeah. Galleria. Yeah. In San Francisco. every angle. Just because I really like the shrimp tempura. If it was just shrimp tempura place, I'd give it a 10. But like Raf said, it was a bit on the steep end, and I really like the ambiance. The service was awesome. The soup could have been a little bit more, and the bowl could have been a little bit bigger. I feel like it looked like we a, got a large. I mean, we got a regular. It looked big because the udon noodles are big. Yeah. The get a large next time. The, the, shrimp, the shrimp tempura made me fuller than I thought it would. I had more of that than the actual. Udon noodles. All right, let's go. It's so cold. It's fucking free. We just got home and we finished unboxing a couple more packages from Black Friday and Cyber Monday, as you guys already know. But we didn't show you guys because most of them was presents. And we wanted to get started with wrapping some presents. And as we were getting started, we were going to start with these two. I challenged her to a gift wrapping contest. I said that I was a better gift wrapper and she disagreed, so now we're having a contest. I gotta say, I learned from the best, so I think I can wrap much better than her. We'll have to see. Let's get started. Okay. saw I finished first Raph had to cut off some extras on the side just to show you guys you want to go first show them yours mm-hmm 
So here is mine. I like the metallic gold. That does, that does look pretty nice. I'd want to open that. Your turn. And this is mine. <laughs> Presentation is key as well. Uh huh. You gotta use the double sided tape when it's ne needed, you know? And that is mine. <laughs> So you guys will be the judge to decide who's the winner of the gift wrapping contest. We're still trying to decide what the winner will get, but I guess we'll find out once we determine who the winner is. So, if you guys didn't notice, Raph's edges are laid today. I look so white. Damn, you see that? It's even hanging right here. You see it? It's hanging. Let me show you what it looks like before. Before it's all. You want me to do yours? Do you want me to do yours? How do you go into it? Yeah. Hold on. So I'm gonna try laying her baby hairs down because they'd be like everywhere. I've been wanting to do this for a long time because it, her hair is just. I wanna cut it. Well, yeah, we're gonna try it right now. Okay guys, sorry, a change of view. The angle was all bad, the lighting was all bad, but I did my edges today. It was actually just the second time me doing it. It's not that great, but... It looks good. It's okay. It looks clean, like, better. <laughs> better. Than I never lay my edges. For one, I don't know how. For two, I just there's just a lot of baby hair to maintain. And I don't like the flakiness. Well, she doesn't like it because I use gel. I know some people use like some type of oil or something. I don't know, but I use gel. When I sleep with my hair like this and it gets flaky in the morning, so she's just like hella tripping and like, oh, looks like I have dandruff. But yeah, it, it works for its purpose. So Yeah, this is the, her, like she said, it's the only second time she did it. The first time she did it, I just woke up and I was just like, What's in your hair? Why do you have so much dandruff? But I forgot that she laid it. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna try to do hers. Let's see how I do. Do I have to take them out or just leave them? You know? Do you want to redo your hair? No. Okay, then. Okay. Just leave it. So you do it after your hair is done, okay. Yeah, do it after. Do you use this toothbrush for your teeth? No, it's a brand new toothbrush. Okay, just making sure. I feel like you're combing my forehead. <laughs> what? Can you go closer? There you go. You have to go in a swoosh motion, apparently. That's what I saw on YouTube. Who taught you this? YouTube. Oh my gosh, I look like Superman. <laughs> that feels like a lot of gel. I, I honestly, I don't really know what I'm doing. <laughs> Are you serious? Are you gonna make me go out like this? No. <laughs> oh my god. It looks better though, doesn't it? Let's see when you're done. Are you gelling my hair? Baby, just <sighs> please let me do what oh, I do. <laughs> I'm just gonna try to not look and I'm just watching my game. If I'm looking to the left, it's cause I'm watching my game. Or it might look like I'm looking to the right. Are you putting like a blob of gel every like strand? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, that's so cold. Is this how much you're supposed to use? <laughs> I think you got my earlobe. Baby, let me do my thing. Are you gonna hook it under my ear? Oh my god. <laughs> Baby, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, stop it. You're the one drawing S's on my face. Are you doing a swirly? I look at swirly. <laughs> oh my god. I just smell like gel. <laughs> Baby, let me see. This is not my <laughs> Wait, so is it supposed to look like this? That's how it looks, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> what? Let's just 
leave it. Let's just leave oh, it. Hold on. Wait. Just let me just show them the before and after real quick. Just like, do you see this telephone cord thing? <laughs> Does it look good like that? You like it like that? Better than how it was. Oh my gosh, that's on my jawline. What do you do about that? Here you guys. This is the final product. <laughs> I honestly don't know what the what to do with the sideburns, so I just did a s I mean, that's what I did with mine. Does it look the same? Mine sideburns are just darker. <laughs> your sideburns are thicker and longer. If you redid your hair, it would have been better. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think. Was I laid? Or was I played? <laughs> I think I did good, huh? Let me know if you guys have tips and tricks or otherwise, I'll just be watching more YouTube videos. I literally only watched one YouTube video, so... Yeah, Raph, I uh, really like how she learns by example and just by watching. That's how she learned how to braid. That's how she learned how to edit videos. That's how she learned how to do a lot of the things she does. She just looks it up on YouTube or just has to watch somebody, watch how it's done and she'll basically keep doing it on her own and eventually master it. Thank you. I guess I like how my head doesn't look as big as it did. It like... doesn't. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, real quick with it, huh? <laughs> well, right. that's it for today's video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. And while you're at it, click that bell button to get notified when we post. Keep it litty and join the committee. Don't sleep on us and we're out.